News from Northeast Philadelphia this morning. A standoff is over after one person is shot and police lead several men from a house. Eyewitness News reporter Jan Carabeo is live in Frankfurt to tell us what investigators know so far. Jan. Jim and Janelle, good morning. Police remain on the scene here in Frankfurt today. We're told they're waiting on a search warrant so they can go back inside of the home to search for evidence possibly left behind by this shooter. A lot has unfolded here over the last couple of hours. Early this morning, we're told this all started with a shooting right, well, right around 1.30. That turned into a barricade situation. And finally, just a short time ago, a group of men was taken into custody. Eyewitness news on the scene here on the 1700 block of Harrison Street in Frankfurt early Friday morning when four people were let out of a home in handcuffs, all persons of interest in a shooting that left one man injured. This was another tense few hours for police. Officers were called to the neighborhood for reports of shots fired. And when they arrived, they found one victim, a man shot in the shoulder. He was taken to Temple University Hospital and is now in stable condition. Meantime, at this scene, police believe the shooter was still inside this home, so they set up a barricade. SWAT was called in and negotiators got on the bullhorn. Eventually, those four persons of interest were brought out. At least one child was also led away from the scene, believed to be inside the home during the barricade situation as well. And we are learning more about the victim. We're told he is a 57 year old man who actually owns property in this area. He was checking on that property when he was shot, and he tells police that he believes the shots fired came from that house in question behind me here in Frankfurt. We're also told that ballistic evidence, spent shell casings, were found on the back side of that property to back that up. At this time, no known motive for this shooting. We'll keep you up to date, but for now, we're live in Frankfurt. Jan Carabao, CBS 3, Eyewitness News. Jim and Janelle, back into you. Thank you, Jan.